Adrian Otegi's victory at last year's inaugural Belgian knockout followed his first European Tour triumph at the Paul Laurie match play, marking him out as a match play specialist and a man who can hold his nerve under pressure. In Abu Dhabi, Anna Whiteley sought him out for some help with scoring shots from the 100-yard mark. We're down here on the driving range with European tour star Adrian Otegi. And Adrian, it's late in the day. You've been going through the bag. You've ended up on the wedge. Mm -hmm. Which wedge? 50 degrees. 50 degrees. Yeah, I got now, yeah. Which is perfect for the shot that I've been watching you practice for the last 20 mm -hmm. minutes or so. It's kind of a 100 yards approach shot. It's one that a lot of amateurs can thin, they can fat, they can air mail it through the back of the green. What would your approach be to a shot like this? Well, first thing, I mean, this is obviously a precision shot. Mm -hmm. So as we were talking before, uh, I don't really care what club you, you're going to use, uh, but it's just how, pre how precise you, you So I, I can, I'm going to use that uh, 50 degrees now, but if it's a nine, nine iron for you, yep. just use the nine iron. You don't have to try to compare yourself with, uh, with the other player. I will never compare myself to you. So, <laughs> <laughs> no, not to God. me, but even, even to, uh, to anyone. Yeah. So yeah. just uh, you have to know what, what distance you do with, with each club yeah. and then just try to swing it normally. Um, okay. I don't, I, I mean, depending on, on what's your level, mm -hmm. don't try to be like too precise. If you do like, let's say, we're, we're trying to do like a 100 meter uh, shot now, but if, yeah. if you with your 99 you're like 105, just try to make your 105 shot. Okay. And even if you're five meters long, it, it'd be fine. If you don't hit it that well and you, you finish 102, you'll be, you'll be even yeah. better. So. so it's knowing your yardages and, do, and hitting a full swing. Exactly. Yeah. That, that's, and if, uh, in, my, in, in my case, if you want to go a little bit shorter, just grip it down a little bit. Mm -hmm. And then if, unless, uh, um, instead of hitting 105, you might hit like 102 and that would be, that'd be better. But just swing it normally. Don't try to do experimentation. Just okay. swing, swing it normally, maybe grip down a little bit and, and see how, okay. how the yardage is. Right, off you go. All over that pin. So just try to obviously make a good contact. Uh, use the bounce of the club, like hit the ground, mm -hmm. and just try to make a good contact. And okay. then repeat, repeat, repeat. OK, sounds good. So just over the red flag. Try to make a good, good rhythm and make a good contact. Lovely. Why do you think this kind of shot can stress quite a few amateurs out? Because I imagine they can be up to this point in two shots and then it can go so wrong from, from this kind of distance. Well, in, in my opinion, if you, I mean, you have to try to play the, sh the best shot uh, you can at, on every, every moment. Mm -hmm. But if you, if you are better, like let's say at 120 yards, try to give yourself a 120 yard shot. Don't, yeah. you, don't it's not, I mean, Closer to the hole is not necessarily always better. Yeah, that's so, a good so, point. So just try to know what's your strength and what's your weakness, and try to leave yourself always like your your best, the best shot you you have. Yeah. It's not necessarily the closest to the hole. Yeah, uh, so don't just get up as far as you can. And, exa exactly. and so in terms if, of precision, as mm -hmm. you mentioned, what's the best way to start working towards the flag and starting to get as close as possible? What's your best tip for precision? Um, well, first of all, try to. Um, try to know where you want to make the ball bounce. Yeah. So obviously depending on how the green is, if it's firmer, if it's softer, uh, it can be like before the pin or after the pin, just, just depends. But try to focus on when you want to land the ball. That's mm -hmm. always my, my advice in the short game. Yeah. This is a, like a full shot, but even around the green on a short game, uh, always try to focus on where you want to land the ball. Okay, so it's uh, not necessarily so just, bang at the pin. Exactly, just forget the pin and okay, what kind of shot do I want to play? So higher, lower, mm -hmm. and then once you know the trajectory, just focus on where you want to land the ball. Okay. That's my advice. Give us one more. Okay. <laughs> so the same thing, just focus on the target. Just make a good rhythm and a good contact. Lovely. You can't go wrong with that. Good stuff. There you go, and then Thank you, so you try to repeat the same shot as many times as possible to be more consistent on the golf yeah, course. Yeah, yeah. You can't be afraid of the driving range. This is where the work happens. Thank you very much for <laughs> your time. Thanks very much. And hopefully that will all help you back at home as well.